Well, for the last two years I've been working exclusively on paintings and, um, and trying to get some of the ideas that I've been working on in other pieces of work um, into that medium. So before I'd done a lot of work that was chemical reactions in which there was the flowing of um, chemicals and liquids onto a metal surface that captured something of nature and the idea of um, nature being a flow of different materials under certain forces such as gravity and uh, heat, time. Um, and I took that idea of the pain being absorbent and, and taking in the forces that were going on around it and applied that not just to physical forces but also to emotional forces, sociological forces, political forces and try to uh, let the work develop a kind of uh, complex surface. And so these represent um, complex surfaces on the theme of flow, of everything interconnecting and flowing into each other. I, I still use um, systems, I think. I think whenever an artist starts painting, they have a, a rule or an idea of what they're going to paint. But there's a lot more emergence, the idea that things occur over time and ideas change. And, just try and be open. All these uh, pieces, none of them, at the beginning I knew what they were going to be. I just kept working on them and things developed and I just trusted that eventually a show would come out that was coherent and made sense. It just so happened that these were the themes that appeared. Uh, I, took, I can't, couldn't tell you when a painting ends or starts, it just sort of has a rightness about it when it's got to a, a, a narrative or a surface or something. It has a certain complexity. It's a, elegance or an inelegance, it's, it's a very difficult question to answer.